Yo yeah, guys, what's going on? I'm the Twitchy Gamer, and welcome to my let's play of LEGO Marvel Super Heroes 2. So, let's get into it. I might just adjust the sounds before we do anything. As otherwise, you guys might not be able to hear my voice very well. So, just a bit more. <coughs> so, yeah, um, LEGO games are actually one of my favourite games to play. Um, mainly the Marvel ones. Didn't necessarily like Marvel, Lego Marvel Avengers, but I loved the first Lego Marvel Superhero, so hopefully this game is just as good. Let's get straight into it. Create a save. Oh god, it's saving. Yeah, wonderful. Wonderful, wonderful. Alrighty guys, so I'm not sure if you actually saw that, if it cut out or anything like that at the moment. You just have to save. <clears throat> I'll also try not to talk within the cutscenes as well. Well, oh, it's Baby Groot. Oh, starting off playing as the Guardians, I'm very happy about that. Everything okay up there? Honestly, it's best not to think about it. Hey, I heard that. Give your opinions about my flying to yourself, Quell. Let's just get out of this pigsty and make it to the airlock. Well, haven't played one of these for a while. Just got to get used to the controls again. I believe you hold in. Okay, yeah. If you hold in circle, he actually starts playing music. That's pretty cool. I'm going to try not to do that just in case I get copyrighted by accident. There we go. Jesus. Like, even though I'm already, you know, like, just started it, I forgot how fun these games were. And sorry if I'm, and also, I apologise if I don't, you know, play very well. It is like 1am and I've been out all day, so I'm extremely fucking tired right now. But I still wanted to make the video, so I figured why not. Oh my god, what is going on? What is this? Oh, we gotta blow it up. And we need Captain America's shield for that flame. Anything over here we can break? Yes, plenty of stuff. There's always plenty of stuff to break in these games. Gotta do everything for studs. We need them studs. We fucking need them. Okay, we can't go there. And can we place anyone else? No, it's just Star Lord and Drax. That's alright, I guess. I'm just really excited to play as, what's it called, Spider-Man, as Spider-Man is actually my favourite Marvel hero. Does that work? Oh. No. Do we need to shoot that, or what are we, fuck we doing? Okay, no, I don't know what we're doing there. Anyway, let's get back to breaking stuff. That is the most important thing to do. <clears throat> uh, Rocket, think you could take a break from crashing my ship and open this hatch for us, please? What? It's not already open? Must be jammed or something. Great. We'll need to use the emergency manual override I told you guys about. I feel like I might get some hate for playing this game, but honestly, I don't even care. It's just a fun game. I don't know, I've always enjoyed LEGO games ever since, I believe it was, I think LEGO Star Wars, I think, 
not a hundred percent sure what just happened. The blue yellow. <laughs> what are we supposed to be doing? <laughs> oh, it's to get a mini kid. Oh, alright. There we go, we got it. <laughs> Not sure if they're called mini kits in this, but. I know that they're mini kits in, um. In the Lego Star Wars franchise, that's for sure. Yeah, I'm not sure what they're called, but we'll find out at the end of this level. <laughs> I, I'm sorry if I'm annoying you from, like, taking ages to actually do this, but you got to get all the studs. You have to. <laughs> Talking about other Lego games, I actually platinumed Lego Batman 3, I think it was. <laughs> um... I went on holidays and I had it on the Vita and I figured, you know, why not <coughs> just play it. I played it on the, I think I had an eight hour train trip. So played it on there for pretty much the whole train trip and got through it. It's a pretty easy platinum. If you do have a Vita and you know, you want to just get an easy platinum, I, platinum, I would really recommend Lego Batman 3. As all the levels are actually split up into three. Um, so it's like you've got the main level and pretty much you spend about yeah, each one, you know, if a level's half hour, you spend about 10 minutes doing each part, and it's pretty easy, in my opinion. I think I only had to actually redo about three or four levels to get, like, the true superhero status, anyway, so. There's our exit. Just gotta use a gravity mine to get this stuff out of the way. Why is there a reinforced plate over the controls? Well, you know how Groot likes pressing buttons. I kind of don't want him anywhere near that one. Hmm. An actual sensible precaution. Yeah, don't sound too oh. surprised. Of course, blame Groot for everything. Fucking hell. Groot is amazing. No. Especially baby Groot. But no, teenage Groot is so much funnier. <laughs> if you have watched Guardians of the Galaxy 2, you know, there's an end credit scene, which it... I don't need fucking help. Fuck off. But, um, when I, yeah, I know, I know, oh my god. But, um, <clears throat> you know, if you haven't seen Guardians Volume 2, it's actually pretty funny, and there's a post credit scene where Groot's actually grown up into a teenager, and Star-Lord comes in, and he's like, you know, stop playing video games, and stop shedding and clean it all up, and it's just, it's, <laughs> it's really funny, Groot actually just acts like a normal teenager. Is this more stuff to blow up? We've got a few things. Oh, that was pretty cool. I should probably give Drax a proper try, but I don't know. I'm not even sure what is going on in this story at the moment. And we finally died. <laughs> Took a while, but we finally died. Oh, I want the fucking studs. Oh, right, I If we survive this, I vote we have trial runs for future emergencies. <laughs> Is it time to skydive? That was one of the things I really liked about Lego Marvel Superheroes 1, actually. Good on you, Drax. <laughs> So glad they added actual voices into this. Wild guess here. This Kang the Conqueror is big on time travel. I remember in the original Lego games where they wouldn't talk, they'd just mumble and say weird. They'd have like a weird Lego language or something like that. So I tell you what, I'm so glad they added in the normal voices. Oh, hello, Guardians. Thank you for your assistance. A rescue boat 
Should be arriving to pick up the last of the civilians now. Please do everything you can to help clear the area, but keep an eye out for Kang's forces. An eye out? How does she expect us to see if we <laughs> your speech, <clears throat> What are we supposed right, to be doing? Do we have to jump over that or what? What? What's up with the it says to jump and I am. Oh. Nothing we can do with that either. Oh great. Why was it telling me to jump before? Anything down here? Gotta explore every area. You have to in these games. So I'm not sure how long this part is gonna be, but what I'm going to try my best to do is just do like one episode per mission. Because why the fuck not? That'll probably just make things a whole lot easier. And then after I'm done, done that, uh, if you guys want to see me, you know, do all the stuff in like the main area, you know, unlock characters and do all that stuff, I'm cool to do that. I might actually, I'll probably try and platinum this. Um, platinuming these games are fairly easy in my opinion. So it's, yeah. <laughs> They're pretty easy platinums in all honesty. Um, I believe that if you do use cheat codes, it, um, I think it bans, well not ban, I think it disables trophies. I'm not sure, I know that uh, Lego, Lego Star Wars a complete saga when it first came out on 360. I believe you, if you use them, uh, like cheats, I, no it wasn't that one, I think it's like Indiana Jones or something like that. If you use cheats, it disables trophies and achievements, so. I'm not sure if this one does, but it might. Anyway, I wouldn't use cheats anyway because it's ruins the fun in my opinion. But I mean, if once you've saved up enough studs to get the the two times multiplier, honestly, everything just becomes so much easier. It's a bit of a grind to get the two times, but then the good thing is all the multipliers actually stack. So when you get four times, you're on eight, and it's just it's pretty damn cool in my opinion. It's not looking good. There's chaos everywhere. Those <clears throat> civilians aren't going anywhere unless we put those fires out. Perhaps there's something on the upper level we can use. <clears throat> or Captain America's shield. You know, where the fuck is he at? this Kang guy? And what does he want, anyway? And also, I believe when you get combos, you get a uh, multiplier as well. And then that affects your studs, I believe. Um, not a hundred percent sure, but you know, I think that's what happens. So, I think the best thing to probably do is actually, you know, kill some enemies and then go for collecting the studs. Probably, it, it, I feel like it'd help in the long run, in all honesty. Oh fuck! I thought that was an enemy. It was Jack. <laughs> what are you talking about, mate? You're the one who's shooting, not me. Fuck no. I love that combo. Screw it. Let's play as Gamora. Let's try. Try her out. What the fuck is going on? What? Oh, Jesus. A spin to win combo. Is this Dark Souls or something? Fucking hell. This game is probably... I feel like Dark Souls is probably a bit more fun than this. Oh, is that what studs that I see up there? They are. I just want to try and get the true hero thing just so, you know, I won't have to come back and replay it. Because I'm not sure if they have a true thing for free play and story mode like they have in some games. But, you know, that's the case. I just don't want to have to come back into, into story mode because I prefer, I prefer the free play levels in all honesty. It's so much more entertaining because with them obviously you know you can play as anyone <laughs> is there anything else I missed down here <laughs> don't miss it oh fuck you you prick getting getting them studs paying the bills the fuck is that is that a clown what the hell I hope they do eventually make a new, like, DC, like, um, Lego game and they add, like, the TV show characters. I'd really like to see, like, the TV show Flash and 
all that. I'm kind of upset that, like, in Injustice 2 as well, that they didn't actually bring in the, like, the TV show character costumes. Because I believe a lot of the characters are actually in the TV show. I think, yeah, we got Flash, Supergirl, Arrow. I think there's Superman. He's not in it too much, but he is in Supergirl. Who else is there? Uh, we got Captain Cold. We now, well, I'm not sure if the Atom's out yet, but we're getting the Atom in DLC. Uh, I really can't think off the top of my head. We got Black Canary as well. And they could actually do like three different costumes for her due to the fact that there are, there's the original Canary, then there's the Black Canary, which is Laurel, and then the new Canary, which, the new Black Canary, which is Dinah. So, yeah, that would be, that would have been pretty cool to say that. But, you know, I'm not sure. Because they did it with, um, the first Injustice game. They actually had, um, the arrow, like an arrow costume with, um, what was like the TV one? The Stephen Amell TV character. It does look pretty cool. I believe, um, sorry, I just had to scratch my eyebrow. I do believe when that happened as well, they released a new 52 ver comic version of The Flash. Not sure. I know I did get it, but... But yeah. Oh, Stan Lee's in there. Fuck. Do we collect him as well? Yes, we got to collect Stan Lee. I believe that's a hidden character. Four, oh, ten mini kits and... Four golden bricks. So. Yeah, well, you know what? We gotta get the studs first. And we gotta go get rid of all the water. No, we. Yeah, what are we doing up here? So, first we'll destroy everything. As I've said multiple times, studs are everything in this game. And we're about to hit 100,000k. If only this was as, like doing this was as it. Oh my god! If only making money was as easy as breaking things in like in this game. That would be amazing. Let's go break a chair in your living room, or something, then you get some money. That'd be that'd be pretty cool. <laughs> what are we? Oh, it's like an elevator. Oh no, it's not. It's like a cupboard. Do we have to build stuff? Hello? Yeah. What the fuck are we doing here? I really don't know. Oh, we gotta get up. Oh, I think there's more stuff that we gotta... Gotta grab. So I feel like, well, yeah, we gotta be Star-Lord to go up there, I think. I'm not 100% sure. But we will go on that. Get it to go down. We'll grab those studs quickly. Fly up. We'll break more things. Get more studs. Get that dosh. And we're about to hit true superhero anyway, so I'm pretty pretty happy about that. Still gotta rescue the three people, I believe. But we'll get to that in a second. I am so fucking tired. <laughs> Stand aside. My mighty strength shall destroy this moderately damaged wall. Fuck off, Jax. I only like you in the movies because you're played by Batista, but that's literally the only reason. I do not like you in the comic books whatsoever. <laughs> but the first um, Guardians movie, I actually didn't actually, I didn't actually enjoy it, so. I'm surprised I enjoyed the second one, in all honesty. Can we hit it? Oh, I feel like it's like 100,015. Now this will open. What are we doing now? Alright team, that did it. Now we've got our very own fire extinguishing drone. Ooh, fuck yeah, that's what we want. Oh god, there's studs, quick. Quick, yeah, get out of the, get rid of the, that. get rid out of the fucking cutscenes. Oh, hurry up, please. 
I need the fucking studs. Give me my damn studs, please. Whoa! Drax has been a fucking cooked, mate. Doesn't know what's going on. Can we hit it? There we go. Oh, true believer. Fuck yeah, we got it. There's one, um... One golden brick that we've gotten. Fucking cheering about that. So what do we have to do? Oh, do we have to be... What is going on? Oh, more studs. Fuck yeah, I'm cool with that. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> this is fun. Oh, I wish we could control it. That's not fair. Hmm. Gravity mine. Oh, there's stuff down here. How did I not notice that? Well, you don't necessarily need to be collecting studs, but... Fuck it. You know, couldn't hurt. The more studs we get, the more characters we can buy, I believe. But I'll probably just save straight up to get the... The two times. Because I feel like the two times is probably the most important thing that we can buy at this point in time. I'll we'll save up for. Yeah, it's great. Oh my god, fuck, how is Drax so damn strong, like, honestly? I really didn't think he was this fucking strong. Congratulations, folks. You've just been saved by the legendary... Hey, where's everyone going? Nobody wants a Star-Lord autograph? Fuck off, Star-Lord. Now what, we got like one more group? Yeah, nice rocket. I just want to be able to play as Baby Groot. Like, what the fuck? Why is he talking? That's not normal. Rocket, do you have anything that can destroy this reinforced metal? Of course. <clears throat> Unlike some of you guys, I'm always prepared for situations like this. Yeah, nice. Can Groot even do anything? Like, I... Why do I feel like he can't? Can we play as baby Groot? Oh, yes! We're little Groot. Fuck yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm happy now. We can play as Groot. <laughs> so happy about that. I don't think we would be, be able to. I mean, like, in the story at least. Just because of how small he is. Yeah. Does he have a... Oh, he's got like an electric fan. Maybe that would be... Might be able to melt that gold that we saw down here. <laughs> oh, that's pretty cool. How he jumps. I'll quickly go and see if he can actually break through this. I honestly doubt it. But, you know, there's... You, we can always give it a try. No, nah, we need Iron Man or someone like that. Oh, that's right. Get rid of them fucking Ronald McDonald looking cunts. Because fuck them. What, will we be able to get Stan Lee out? <laughs> what the? Yeah, how do we help you, mate? Oh, no, he's up here. Oh, can we get you out? Hello? We need someone. I'm not sure who the fuck that is, but... Oh, well. Anyway, we'll break this metal. I think that's it. I think this is it. I'm not... Oh, no, there it is. Alright. Cool, cool, cool. Oh, fucking hell. There we go. Nice work. Now we just need to help them reach the boat. Time to be Groot. What the? <laughs> Whoa. How did Groot just do what that? the fuck? 
That little time gizmo we found lets him grow and shrink anytime he wants. Or get older and younger if you want to get technical about it. Doesn't seem to work on anything else, though. I am Groot. That's the last of them. Good job, team. Hell yeah, that's pretty cool. Yeah, once I showed up. No, fuck off, Rocket. Guess we're doing a little overtime, huh? Hey, is that thing attacking my ship? Not cool. Let's move before it does any more damage. <laughs> Holy <laughs> shit, what <laughs> Groot, he's fucking huge. Is it possible to access the defense systems remotely? No, we can't build. Can we build? Yeah, we can build with Rocket, we just can't do anything with fucking Groot, of course. <laughs> now what do we do? Oh man! Ha, I got this one. I'm pretty sure we're almost actually finished the um this level. It's pretty good because I'm ready for bed. I'm so fucking tired, but I'm you know I'll probably end up doing another episode after this. But I really have no clue. I'm so damn tired. Okay, that did it. Now we just need to get up there and fire the thing. <laughs> What are we supposed to be doing? Do we jump back in the ship or...? <laughs> what the fuck are we doing? Hello? Hello? Oh, there we go. <laughs> Do we get to shoot it ourselves? I hope so. What the? Meh. Yeah, of course we're gonna keep fucking firing. We're gonna pound this bitch. We'll kill him. Die. 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 Yeah, I know that. You can tell it's flaming. Of course it's nearly defeated. The new, the new enemy, Kang. What the fuck's he doing now? What the fuck is that? What the hell? What in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ is that? A celestial? I don't fucking know. Looks like something out of fucking Skylanders. It legitimately looks like something out of Skylanders, the first game. Like, what the hell? Ace on the searcher. Fuck me, this level's actually going pretty long. I think it's just because I'm not used to how long the levels are. Like, I'm so used to, like, Lego Batman. What are we supposed to be doing? 
not this time. What the fuck is going on here? What the hell? Yeah, what? More of that Kang time travel technology. Oh, we got the ten thousand. The ten thousand stud. The purple one. We need to put a stop to that laser beam. Any ideas? No, not really. What new pal? <laughs> that works. And I'm no, I was gonna say we might have to turn into Drax. No, we don't know. I thought we might have to. Oh well. The fuck. A booster. What? There we go. Hey, I think it's working. You don't say, but how can something like, it may be a little gravity thing, but how could something like that do that? Like in all honesty, that does not make sense to me at all. Guarantee we have to jump on top of him. No, we don't. Uh-oh. What is going on now? <clears throat> oh, it's getting rebuilt. Of course. Oh. No. The ship. It remade itself. How is that possible? Time travel, my mate. My friend, time travel. Yeah, let's get in. Let's get in the ship. Plays baby. Can, no, baby Groot can't drive. Guarantee it. There we go. Let's. Is that what are we? Is that what we're shooting? His hand. Oh, it is. Yes. My God, it takes some. It takes some hits. I'm trying to. There we go. Just spam, spam. Oh my god. Is it actually like. It's got auto aim on it, but it's like it does not want to work for me. There we go. That worked. Love how robot, like every enemy, has a weakness. Honestly, like if you're going to create a robot, why give it a weakness? Seriously. Nothing shall stand in my way. Oh. Sorry, I had to yawn. I'm just so fucking tired right now. Jump on that. What is that gonna do for us? What? What is that? What does it even do? Anything at all? No, nothing at all. Oh well. Um. What? What are we supposed to be doing? We, we've got to get up to his shoulder. How the fuck do we do that? What is... Okay, no, I'm... Really not 100% sure what we are supposed to be doing right here. <laughs> maybe we ought to get one character to jump on this. Uh, maybe. There, oh, okay, yep, yeah, there we go. Little catapult, of course. <laughs> can we, can we, can we jump yet? There we go. Something else to build up. No, it's not build. It's just a switch. Why is? Oh my god. Why do they have to have a weakness? Why does everything have to have a weakness? It really confuses me. See, legit, like, all we did was shoot its hand, pretty much just shot its hand, turned a switch, and we, like, nearly killed it. 
And it's chest, oh, of course. Mm -mm -mm. Why would you not put like a guard in there or something like that? And literally a couple bullets will be able to kill it. There we go, we beat it. I think we beat it, or it's just weakened a little bit. Up, oh, gravity mind booster thing. The big scary robot that wants to destroy us? Yeah, I noticed that already. Now I'm talking about the gravity booster in his chest. Think you could use that? You mean attach a gravity mind to something as powerful as a celestial? There's no telling what might happen. Good point. We should definitely <clears throat> use it. Yeah, well too late. I've already used it. And it's dead. Yeah, of course. Yeah, you better run. We are victorious. Again. Thank you. You bought us enough time for our evacuation ships to clear Kang's forces. Hey, no problem. The bigger they are, the, the more they hurt you. Hey, well, ask them what our reward is. You greedy motherfucker rocket. Jesus Christ. Greedy dog. Um, what are those? Our cue to leave. Come on. <laughs> the fuck is that? That ship looks awesome in Lego, honestly. Oh, so that's the sword they were talking about. I honestly had no clue. An emergency broadcast from Terra. Earth? Surely Kang isn't there already. That's impossible. Are they not on Earth? Why do we gotta help them? Because we're the guardians of the galaxy. I thought they ejected him, honestly. And there we go, got a trophy. Did we just finish the mission? Yes, we did. Unlocked free play. Got True Believer. And we got plenty of fucking studs, that is for sure. And one mini kit. Didn't rescue him, obviously. There we go, all the characters we've unlocked. Oh, this is gonna take ages to unlock each character, guarantee it. It's a massive amount. Oh, and then we got our custom characters. Can't wait to do that, I'm gonna make the flash. Because I think if Quicksilver's in this game, which I feel like he will be, I'll be able to make, like, the Flash as a, as a character. I did that in the original LEGO Marvel Superheroes game. It's pretty cool. But, I mean, you can't put his mask, so I just named him Barry Allen. But, um, yeah. Why is Rocket all the way over there? What the fuck? And why is Star Lord all the way over there? That doesn't. That confuses me a little bit. Maybe it could be going in alphabetical order? I'm hoping not. Well, that wouldn't make any sense then. That does not make any sense. Anyways, guys. Thank you so much for watching and sticking through. Um, I will catch you in the very next video, which should be uploaded not too far off this one. I think I'm going to be uploading this in the morning. 
and I'll probably upload the next one as well but anyway I will catch you all in the next video remember be sure to sub uh, rate this video you know do whatever you want to do see you